Hello and welcome to episode 12 of the Liverpool Career Mode. So in today's episode we're going to have a top of the table clash against Manchester United. They've currently played 30 and are on 61 points, we've played 29 and are on 60. So whoever wins this game will go top of the league. Also in today's episode we're going to play a game against Crystal Palace and then sim a game at home to Watford and finish the episode off with a Merseyside derby. Let's have a great episode. So our lineup for today's game against Manchester United, Karius in net, Klein at right back, Gomez and Matip as the centre half as Van Dijk's a little bit tired, Moreno at left back, the normal midfield of Hendo, Cater and Coutinho, Werner on the left, Firmino through the middle and then Oxo chamberlains going to start on the right because Salah's also a little bit tired. The Manchester United lineup: De Gea in net, Mayo at right back, Rojo and Chris Smalling as the two centre halves, Darmian at left back. Then 89 rated Paul Pogba in midfield with Matic. On the right, Bellarabi. On the left, Anthony Martial. And then Mata as the attacking midfielder. And Zlatan Ibrahimovic up front. So no Lukaku or Mkhitaryan or Rashford. So that's good for us. To Coutinho. To Hendo. To Coutinho. Well, we've got a chance here, Coutinho. Can you get there? Well out by De Gea. Martial with space now. Well over by Gomez. Now let's defend this corner. Matt is going to take it. It's a good delivery. Carriers well dealt with. Good tackle by Moreno. Now we'll move forward. Go on Moreno. Run down the line. Into Werner. Pass Rojo. Go on. Back post. Can we get our head? Well dealt with. Navi Keita, overhead kick, Oxley Chamberlain, saved by De Gea. It was offside in the end anyway. The run down Moreno, down the line from Moreno. He's going to whip it in, out by De Gea. Hendo win that header. Coutinho on the edge of the box. Oh, great save by David De Gea. To down the line to Bellarabi, he's got a bit of space now. He's whipped it in, fine, well dealt with. Matic now, they're running at us, they're putting on a lot of pressure, put a foot in, good save by Carrius. good patient build up play here by United, can we win the ball back, Klein, stand your man, stand your man, don't let a cross in, take the ball, but well out by Carrius there, the danger's not cleared though, Pogba, into Ibra, good tackle by Matty. half time now, 0-0, nil -nil. there's not been many chances in this game, it's been a very tight game, Good defending from both sides. So it's half time now. We've just made two changes. Emre Chan and Lalana have come on. Philippe Coutinho and Navi Keita. Come on, let's have a great second half. Good one two between Oxlade and Lalana. Oxlade's still got the ball. Into Lalana. He's managed to keep it in. He's still got the ball. Can he cross it now? Can Emery Chan get his head on it? It's fell back to Lallana on the edge of the box. He's had a shot. Oh, he's hit the post. What a goal that would have been from Adam Lallana. Bellarabi's running at us with pace now. Matip's commit himself. Oh, and that squeezed in in the near post. Harry should have done better. It fell to Mata and he poked it straight at the keeper and it's gone under Carrius's arm. Hendo now into Lallana again. Outside to Oxley Chamberlain. He's put it in. To Werner at the back post. Wide. Into Lallana now. Hendo. Firmino, oh it was Werner, but straight at De Gea once again. Now Firmino's got the ball. And Werner's got a great chance here, you've got to score that. Get in, one all, very patient build up play. Nice one twos in the middle of the park. Werner ran into the open space, he was found nicely. Nice touch, nice finish, one all now, 77th minute. Nice assist there by Joe Gomez. 
Werner. Back post to Oxley Chamberlain. Can he get a shot off? No, he can't. Defended well by Manchester United. And now they're going to hit us on the counter. 3v1 against Matty here. Oh, they've hit the bar. Oh, I thought it had gone in. But Manchester United have just missed an easy chance. United, they've made it 2-1 in the 90th minute, Martial off the bench, in fact no, Martial started the game but 88th minute goal for Manchester United for Anthony Martial. Go on, let's go straight from kickoff. off Klein's running into the space now. Ah, oh, Firmino's just missed it. De Gea with a great save. Carries has come up for the corner. It's a good delivery. Dealt with by De Gea. Manchester United beat us 2-1. It wasn't deserved. We battered them. Well, we didn't batter them, but we were definitely... If anyone was to win, it was us. We deserved it. We had more shots on target by three. And we had more possession. Very unfortunate to go away with a 2-1 loss there. Now for the game against Crystal Palace away in the league. We're going for a backup side with Van Dijk and Salah in because they were too tired to, to play against United. So it's Mignolet in there, Arnold at right back, Robertson at left back, Lovren and Van Dijk, the two centre-halves. Then a midfield three of Chan, Wijnaldum and Ajaria. And a front three of Salah on the right, Brooks Lennon on the left and Woodburn through the middle. The Crystal Palace line-up, Skorupski in there. Don't know how to say his name. Sanchez at right back, Riedervold and Fosu Mentor at centre half, alongside ex Liverpool player Mamadou Sacco. Banner on Hull at left back, right mid Zaha, centre mid McCarthy and Miljovic, another name I can't say. Left mid Townsend, and up front Christian Benteke also playing against his former club. With Townsend as the right into Wijnaldum. He's through here. Can he finish? Yes, he can. 1-0 straight away. Great ball into Wijnaldum from Majaria. And he's just too fast for the defenders. Great start to this game. Five minutes in, we're already 1-0 up. Look at this dribbling from Wijnaldum. Very fast, very skillful. And then a nice finish into the top left corner. Majaria into Woodburn. Over to Lennon. Can he keep this in? Nice goal by Lennon. going to whip it in now. We've won ourselves a corner. Good play by Lennon there. We're going to whip it in with Mo Salah. We've won the header. Lovren straight at Skorowski. And Benteke has made it 1-0. Townsend had it on the left. He ran inside way too easily. And Benteke scores on his return against Liverpool. Very nice finish from him, very composed. Townsend skipping past his defenders too easily. A nice finish into the top right by Benteke. Woodburn's got the ball now. He's waiting for an attacking run from someone. Or maybe Woodburn will go himself. He's hit this. Great save by the keeper. We've got a corner now. Salah's going to take this one again. He's put it into the mixer. It's fell to Ajaria. Oh, poor pass by him, and now Palace are going to counter. Ajari has run it back though. No, he's not. He's giving away a free kick. Ajari now driving through the midfield. Over to Lennon. Into Ajari. Oh, poor effort. Townsend running forward now. Into Benteke. Back to Townsend. What a shot by him, and it's come off the bar. Let's get this clear now. Come on. Don't concede. Oh, great defending by Lovren. And that's the half-time whistle. One all at half-time. Palace came close to scoring just before the half-time whistle. But apart from that, it's been a decent half. We just brought Kamano on off the bench for Brooks Lennon on the left-hand side. Let's see if he can make an impact. James but first we need to defend this against Crystal Palace. They're moving the ball forward nicely. Oh, he's passed Chan. Good defending there. Now we can release Kamano. One straight away off the bench. 
Come on now. He's got a chance to score here. Can he score? Yes, he can. Come on now. Instant impact off the bench. What a finish. What a run. Come on, Liverpool. Brilliant goal from him. The opposition this far up the pitch now. Oh, what a save that is by Mignolet to prevent us going from to 2 all. What a fantastic save. Benteke won the header in the air. And what an unbelievable save that is by Mignolet. Benteke. Palace are through here. Oh, what an opportunity that was for Zaha to make it 2 all. Just wide of the target. Good play by Benteke again. Not far off from Zaha. Whip it in. Goal. Oh, well defended by the Palace defender. We've got a corner though. What can we do? Wijnaldum whips it in. Straight to the keeper. Benteke. He's with the ball and what a delivery that is. And what a save again by Mignolet. What a game he's having. Look at this for a save from close range. What a great hand that is. Townsend's running into the area now. He's found them at the back post and they've equalised at the very end of the game. Two games in a row now where we've conceded late on, this time in the 90th minute. Wilfred Zaha at the back post. Ah, oh, we need to defend better late on in games. And the game finished 2 all. It was probably deserved to be fair. Mignolet made some fantastic saves. And Palace definitely deserved an equaliser. But to concede late on in the second match in a row is very disappointing. We need to improve our defence late on in games. So we've got a youth monthly squad report. Let's see who we've got. Is there going to be anyone decent? Not from you. Not from you. This guy could be very good. 74 to 94 potential value of 325 grand. So he's probably going to be around a 60 rated. Anyone else? No one else, but that we have got one decent youth player there. Now for a league game at home against Watford. We're going to sim this one. If we win this, we'll be only three points behind Manchester United. So in the last three matches, they've lost to West Brom, drew to Arsenal and drew to Bournemouth. So hopefully we can put another loss on their record and beat them here at Anfield. 20 minutes in, we're 1-0 up. Mo Salah scored. That's good. Let's hold on now. Shall we? Can we get another goal before half-time? There's an injury, but fortunately it's not for us. Half-time, we're 1-0 up. Kamano's come on for Salah. Quadrados, we equalise for Watford. Come on. Let's get a final goal. 15 minutes left. We're going to skip it. We've drew one all at home to Watford. Poor result. Now for the final game of this episode. There's only six games of the league left this season. And we're currently five points behind first Manchester United. So let's beat Everton and get as close as we can to them and hope they drop points. To be using our strongest lineup, Werner, Firmino and Salah as the front three. Keita, Coutinho and Hendo as the mid midfield three. Keita's gone up to an 85, so that's great from him. And then the back four of Klein, Matty, Van Dijk and Moreno. And we're going to give Carriers another shot in there against Everton. The Everton lineup, Pickford in net, Dawson at right back. Fools at centre half alongside Funes Mori. Never heard of that Fools person before. Michael Keane's also playing as centre back, so three at the back. Chrissy, Chris Guito at left back, I think he's a Russian player. Idrissa Gate, 84 rated, alongside 84 rated Schneidel, and there's the two defensive midfielders, so the defence have good cover. Then Sigurdsson at Cam alongside Wayne Rooney, and Umar Nias up front. Oh, Firmino with a shot straight away and a great save by Pickford. We've got a corner early on in this match. Coutinho to take it. It's over everyone. No one's managed to get their head on that, but a good delivery from Coutinho. We've still got the we got the throw in from it though. Plans whipped it in, straight to Pickford. Hendo over to Moreno. He's gonna drive inside. He's still going Moreno, finish that, oh poor effort, he done so well to get in the box and just no end product from Alberto Moreno. Coutinho now inside, to Firmino, back to Coutinho maybe, round Pickford, oh well out by Jordan Pickford, great keep in there. Coutinho, into Moreno, he's through again. Can he score this time? What a save that is by Pickford. Pickford's having an amazing start to this game. 
over to Navi Keita, to Coutinho, he's turning, can he get a shot off now, good block by the defender, 20 minutes in we've got a corner, Coutinho's going to take it, into the danger zone, Werner's going to win it, no he's not, out for a goal kick, oh good ball over to Dawson, what a cross that is, and Everton, straight in to carry us. Everton with a free kick now. We know Sigurdsson's dangerous from this position. It's hit the wall, thank God. It's a Craig Dawson. That's in the ass. Stop the cross. We fouled him. He's crossed it anyway. They've still got the ball. Well defended at the back post. Now can we win the header there? We can't. Umani has his turn. Moreno. Matic's coming over. Deal with it this time. Got the cross. Well done, Coutinho. But they've given a foul for the earlier challenge on the ass. And Matic's been booked for that. It's just popped up before this Everton corner saying Firmino's injured, but I don't know how because I don't remember him being injured. But carries with a save from the corner. Now can we move forward? Hendo, Decatur. Over to Salah. Can he get there? Yes, he can. Can he whip it in to Firmino? No, he can't. Well dealt with by the defender. We've got a corner now just before the half time whistle. Coutinho's going to whip it in. Can we win it? Yes, we can. And Firmino, it says he's injured, but he doesn't care. He scored from the corner in the 45th minute. Great ball in by Coutinho. What a header by Roberto Firmino. And a special goal. Well, if you put it on the Let's have another look at this. What an unbelievable header into the bottom corner. Pickford had absolutely no chance with that one. So we've just made three substitutions. We've changed to a 4 1 2 1 2 narrow formation. Chance come on at centre half for Van Dyke, who's also booked and looking tired. Then we brought off Coutinho and brought on Oxley Chamberlain in the attacking role. And then we're going to try Alexander Arnold in centre mid. It says he can play there. He's got good stats, and we're going to bring him on for Mo Salah. So let's win this second half again. For me now. now. Oh, what a challenge that is by the Everton defender. Now they're going to move forward. Oxley Chamberlain, can you make it back? And Mo can in the air win that. Well played. Oxlade's fresh off the bench, he's going to go for a bit of a run now. No, he's not, he's been intercepted straight away. Sigurdsson with a free kick out wide now. Oh, Adrissa Gay coming very close to scoring in Abby Cater. Moreno. Back post, Firmino you've got to score that, no, how have you missed, Firmino with a golden chance to make it 2-0 and he's missed an open net. Everton with a chance now, well out by Carrius, what a great keeping that is, no way is that a penalty, Carrius just went over, blocked his shot, that's great keeping in my opinion, he's been given a yellow card but I don't think that's a penalty. Let's have another look at this on the replay. I thought Carrius just got his body in the way. Oh, I'm not sure whether that's a penalty. I think he's gone down quite easily, but Everton with a chance to make it one all. Sigurdsson, I think he's going bottom left. He's chipped it to the top right corner. It was a really stuttered run up, and Carrius has conceded the first goal for Everton. One all now, 73rd minute. Very strutted run up by Sigurdsson and a very cheeky chip into the top corner. Moreno with space now. He's going to shoot here. Can he score? Yes, he can. Straight from kickoff. We've ca we've scored. We've made it 2 1. Instant response. We don't want to draw this game. We want a three points. We want to get catch up to United at the top of the league. And Moreno showing how to do that with a great finish there. Everton with an 84th minute free kick here now. Good chance to whip it in and get a goal. Fine deal with it. Good save by Carriers. Everton with a chance here. Thank God it was a poor cross. Carriers comfortable for him. 90th minute now. Let's just boot it up. And that's the full time whistle. We beat Everton in the derby. Come on, it's not been a great episode results wise. We've had a lot of draws and we lost to United, but finally we've got our win and it's against Everton. Come on, Liverpool. So Manchester United lost our game, which is great result for us. 
against Manchester City, I think, who beat them. And now we're only two points behind them with five games left. Could this be Liverpool's year? Could we win the Premier League title? So that's been the end of this great episode. Well, I say great episode, it's not been the best results-wise, but it's been decent. We managed to get a result against Everton, and then we drew two games in the Premier League against Palace and Watford, and then unfortunately we lost the game against Manchester United. However, that does bring an end to the episode, so thank you very much for watching. If you enjoyed it, it'd be great if you could drop a like, and if you're enjoying the content on this channel, it'd be great if you could subscribe. So thank you very much for watching. See you in the next video.